In this video, we will be looking at setting up your families to enable interchangeable parts, like so. Here, I have a simple desk family with which I would like to add two sets of legs to allow the user to swap between the two leg types. These are modeled as nested families. So if I create an instance of leg type one, and I have another family called legs type two, and I would like to be able to interchange between these two when this desk is placed inside a project. Note that these leg families have parameters that are associated to parameters within this desk family to ensure the geometry updates accordingly. And these families for the legs came from a very similar template and therefore the origins and reference planes for each of the families are the same. And this is very important when having multiple families nested and you want to be able to swap between them. So I will select these two families and delete them. And I'll just go into my floor plan and place an instance of the legs type one family on the right and the left side. I'll then use the align tool to align the legs to the relevant reference planes. Like so. Just checking in 3D that they align correctly. Once I'm happy with that, I'm going to select both of these leg families. And in the options bar, I have a label drop down list where I can either associate, or if one does not already exist, add a family types parameter. I'll make it instance, and I will call this leg type. And I will group the parameter under construction, like so. And note that the family type parameter is for furniture only. This means that I will only be able to interchange or change the family to other families of the furniture category. Note that the legs are furniture. Click OK. Now that I've done that, I can check this family. So I will go to my family types. Here I have the leg type parameter with default indicating that it is an instance parameter. If I then select on the drop down, note that it is pre populated with legs type 2 because that is the only other furniture family within this family. Change to legs type 2, click apply, and I can see that the legs have changed to the type 2 family. I will change it back. I can now load this family into a project and place it. If I now select on the family, I have the leg type instance parameter. And if I change it to legs type two, the leg family adjusts for this instance here. If I make a copy, and change to a different type. Note that the leg geometry updates to suit. And if I change the leg type to leg type one, the legs change on this instance of this family. 
So that is how to set up family types parameters in order to swap between nested families in your project.